All right, so after playing all the Monarch's journeys, I figured it would be interesting to play a randomized world uh, to potentially get the achievement. What could have been you start a random world with all possible settings set to random and play for 200 years. Now, I've set all this to random. So cultures, religions, all this doesn't make any sense to what we used to. And I set everything in here to random, what could be set to random. Uh, including the Sonsum invasion and the Mongol invasion. I did set off the... Um, du -du -du, where was it? I forget. Uh, there was the option... There we go. The childhood focus alerts to only give us for close relatives because it got on my nerves recently where we got childhood focus events for everything. So... All right, and also in a true fashion, I clicked random a bunch of time to pick this woman randomly to play. Uh, I wanted to play a count to start off there, so that's where we go. And we'll look at everything once it's started. And of course, we play Iron Man, because what would the challenge be? So... Here's our welcome screen. Nothing interesting here, but this is going to be interesting because none of this is going to make sense. So we are of the Kalin, uh, Kalianian culture. This is going to be easier to pronounce in German. Kalianian. Yeah, a little bit. Goes easier off the tongue. Kalianian. Okay, we're just going to call him that. And... The... The religion, I believe, is Bukhishwist? This doesn't make any sense. And we are a uh, Giudessa. I think that's our... That's our council. Our name. So, it's a feudal government. Um, which I believe has pretty much the same rules as we used to. Castle, Fort Hospital. Yep. Tribal Holdings. Okay. Can build castle. Yeah. Alright. Can move capital, yep, tribal are not, okay. Okay, sounds good. And this is... The Buktuist faith is one largely based upon the sense of touch, with adherents locking hands and holding each other's shoulders during prayers. Worshippers frequently embrace the hero fans both before and after the religious ceremony. Bless someone, a hero found must embrace and lift the chosen one towards the sky so that the pantheon may reach down and touch their souls. Their holy text, the grand story, outlines the jealously, jealousy born by the main enemy, the pantheon. Oh, the main enemy of the pantheon, the crimson rider, the one who must not be touched. Interesting. The priests can inherit... Rulers can raid into their neighbors for loot. Okay, interesting. We are hard to convert. There is no religious head. Uh, you perform a rite of passage. And you're born under specific zodiac signs. Right, okay, let's check who we are and where we are. We are this, and we hold... Well, not, not nothing. We hold a bit here, honestly. Now, remember... Despite this being India, this is not India. We are part of the kingdom of Zorini. And we have the... Udia... Udicato of Bar Barasuru. Okay. Right. And this is our... Family symbol. We are of the house on a Gario. And we do have an heir, a son of eight, and a daughter of three. And he's painted funny. Our flag is a fish. That's fantastic. There are three living members. This is all. There's no one else, there's just us on this tree here. I never actually worked with this. Founder, go to head. The head, we are the head. 
All right, okay. <laughs> right, let's check the realm again a little bit closer here. To get this view, you CTR on left click on it. Down on the tooltip, you see all the other things that you do. I never really do these. Um, but right clicking is kind of cool if you read it. Shift right click is our liege. Alt right click. Ooh. And Alt Shift right click. Stuff. Alright, so we'll check King Frabizio of Zironi. This is his heir. And we want to see his vassals. Oh, we're actually the second powerful one. So, what we want, we want to try and get a betrothal with this Duchess. Only as this guy, 35, our three-year-old daughter, oh no. Okay, he's a little bit further away from us, so that's fine. Let's arrange a betrothal between him and us. They all should have shown, okay, this is better. Very good. So we get him. And maybe him I don't know who he is. Oh yeah, he is that guy. Cool. So maybe he has a daughter. He does. Our son is eight. She's twelve. But he doesn't want to because probably she's his only heir. Let's see. We want a few options here. Take the 11 year old, no? No? Probably want a matrilineal, yeah. Did you have someone for our son? You have someone for our son? Okay, they all want matrilineal marriages, understandable. So we'll just restrict his marriage. What is he? He's a Svet Bembara Buktu. Okay. The vassals really like it. What book twist are we? We are D Gambara plus one health. Do we choose this? Or is this our star sign thing? Oh, I like the symbol though. This might actually be more role play than anything else in this game. Okay, what are we good at? We are good at diplomacy, halfway good at martial, not so great at learning. I think. Can we carouse? Does not publicly practice a religion in the Alemposian group. I don't think we are. We are Udiagrian. Ah, oh, these are hard to read. So we should be fine with carousing. Should be able to carouse. So let's invite a few people around here carousing. Including this guy. Guy. And also the Duchess. We want to make a few friends. That's fantastic. I mean, if she had straps back here, that would be some COVID 19 type precautions here. Okay. A lot of swim the Bavara thingies. Okay, we have a ducal conquest that we could do on her. Let's see, what duchy do we belong to? Du jour. The duchy of Vengi. How strong are you? 222 and we have 608. So this one... We definitely start. Now we need piety for it. Uh, 
I'm gonna have a ducal conquest for this as well. We are pretenders to these duchies. How do we figure that out? What duchies we are pretenders to? Can we create this? Uh, yeah, we need to. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We just need to check basically. Yeah, this and this. So we're trying to make peace with a few we could actually go to war against. Okay, we could determine our zodiac sign is if our learning was higher than it is, which it isn't. Get our children focused. I'm not sure what we want here. Let's go for military first. We'll figure it out along the way. Designated regent. Who likes us best? This commander he will be our surgeon. You have the mask already. Uh, you will also be our cupbearer. Will be our court musician. You will be our court poet. Court tour guy as well. The commander's lots of. Oh, we need an ambition. Oh, there's a bunch of options I've never seen. Oh, this one. Become a paragon of enlightenment. More than 2,000 piety. We're never going to reach that. We could go for building a war chest, grooming an heir, make a friend. Let's go for making a friend. We already have a child and the potential of more. Can we have concubines? No. Now, what we need to figure out is how do we get piety out here okay we can't go for a tiger hunt because we don't touch tigers apparently We're going to fight anything else either let's check religions um since Oh, it is pl pretty uniform. Might be able to raid these. Don't have coasts, so we don't have ships. Should we go there and try it? I don't think it works. But we will try. Regardless. Let's raise everyone. We will set them all to looting and we'll see if it works. Also, if we can even afford it. And we play at three speed as a tradition. Can't spend money on anything because we don't have money right now to spend on anything. Alright. We like an alliance. No. Oh. Okay, some people are coming. Everyone is. Good, so we have these raiders and we're going to send them here. And see what works. Wait, we're right next to these. These are our actual neighbors. Go there. Could we potentially declare war on them? First we go raid, then we declare war. And not part of the realm. They're also not very strong. So first we raid this. Ah, we couldn't even get them. News from China. Okay, China still is just China. May the Pantheon protect them. So even if, if we attack them, we wouldn't get very far. Wait, didn't it say infidel neighbors? You guys are the same. Okay, let's see if we can go to somewhere where we don't have a direct border. That works.
We are raiding, but we're also partying at home. And become best friends with this guy on here. Okay, we can't raid here. We can only raid these guys. We've already fulfilled our ambition. And smugglers enter the domains. Not great. Get another ambition. We wish to build... Let's see. Faith or... Build a war chest. Or become queen of Cironi. So Reno. So Rini. <laughs> oh god. I'll bungle this for a good while. I think we'll try and build a war chest. And let's check the societies. They are the peaceful ones. Make you lose wicked traits and gain pious ones over time. Celibacy, okay. Gives monthly piety, so I think we should join them. Costs us a little bit of money, but we want piety to do war. Now we send back our troops, send them down again. Yeah, we need piety for all of this. Could donate to charity for it. Could extort our subjects. You're not going to do that. Could hold a summer fair. This gives us some prestige, which we don't particularly need. I'd like to determine our zodiac sign. Okay, for now we can really only carouse, it looks like. How's the piety gain around us? Plus two. Nine for humble and zealous. Okay. These people are much better suited to the lifestyle than we are. What does a religion do? They're not giving us piety. Why not? Probably not the right buildings there. I'm not going to join a faction. Factionism has broken our backs many times before. If anything, we're going to start a faction. There are no holy orders yet. No great surprise. Technology is basically non-existent. We are an absolute county, yes. Magnetic, cognatic, gavel kind. And we can go for primogeniture and ultimogeniture, okay. Nothing much we can do. Could empower our council, but who would do such a thing? 
if we can get some piety out of this guy yeah we do probably send him to study technology world is not very advanced the coastal regions are much more advanced than anything we have we send them over there Let's have him train troops. Our main holding. This has nothing. This has nothing. This has nothing. Well, we're really starting from utter scratch. But we might as well move our capital to one where there's more slots. Good. Maybe we can take it all. We have a non-aggression pack with them, which is fine. Much. Okay. What else is around here? Yeah, this is the most precious one. So let's fabricate the claim on it. We'll collect taxes at home because we need money. And you do what you do do. And we check our Chancellor. How much gold does he have? 29. So once he's bribed, we know we're not going to get anything out of him. No claim and nothing. Everything in the beginning is small and slow. We'll check back in on him. But now we want to carouse once more. We resolved something between a stable master and someone. Doesn't really matter too much to us. So soon. Just two more weeks and we can carouse again. Can't invite her carousing. Let's go for some northern people here. And our own vassals, especially the ones that are not paying tax. This guy is a strong vassal. Are you good at anything? An okay spy master, but so is this guy. Are you good at no, you're not good at stewardship. We'll just have to live with you hating us. Let's get all our vassals carousing. We're small as of yet, so We could shift the tax focus here, get more money out of our cities, 5% more money. Do they get to decide on it? No, get it. Okay. Some vassals are coming, some vassals are not. Probably set our spy master to support our chancellor. It has helped in the past. You're not in the worst position, quite honestly. We have a bunch of ducal claims.
We don't have all that many barons. Need to set that up higher. Need more troops. And become best friends with our court chaplain. Very good. Is there someone better for this than you? Slightly. Plus two diplomacy for being a dedicated caruser. Massive recruitment drive, very good stuff. Oh, look at that. We immediately start with the immortality thing. I, I just closed the browser window for it because I figured I'm not going to see it once again. Ah, let's see where it leads us. Let us summon the council. And oh, we are going to have to go the diplomacy route, which is good because the marshal and the uh, learning route are not great. So our Chancellor has a chance of 10, which is not great. But we'll send him to find someone to take care of our mortality question. Uh... Oh, we want content. It's good. So this is a nice monastery thing. We don't want to steal it. Contention gives us pressed piety and we have very little of it anyway. What do you want? You want us to donate to charity. How much? You want us to donate all 100 gold. No. Nah. Not right now. Thanks to our great diplomatic uh, skill, the smuggler's ring in Orangulu has been destroyed. The head of the smuggler is now rotting on a pike outside the city gates. Yeah, that's very diplomatic. We're not going to donate to charity. Also, for now, we don't really care about China. Let's turn those news off. We will engage with them when we engage with them, I believe. Oh no, we have fallen. Let's get some help there. And we owe this guy a favor now, our spy master. Which to me means, you know, need a new spy master. Because if he ain't on the council, he ain't doing stuff. Let's send him to build a spy network here. I know it's, it's, there's no real indication. Ah, he went up from, what did he have? 30 something, no? Should have remembered. Oh, he does have a monthly income. This is just generated, I think. Group of robbers, the band of brothers have been brought before us. They will pay with immersement. I'm not sure what immersement means. But they'll pay with it. Hope it doesn't hurt too much. 